Extensive chain and majestic mountains, rise terraces, hills, U-shaped valleys, rivers, lakes, natural, man-made, and even hunted caves. This is Cordillera. And Ifugao Iguro tribe is one of the ethnologistic tribe that lives here. The term Igorot or Igoloti was the term used by Spanish conquerors for mountain people. The Igorots, however, prefer the name Ifugao. Rice is the staple crop for the Ifugao, and they have built some of the biggest and most advanced rice terraces in the world. Up to this day, many of the tribes still practice Thanksgiving rituals. They observe rituals when they tattoo, mummify, it also includes chanting, playing of gongs, dancing, drinking wine, and sharing food. One of their most famous ritual celebrated is the Punuk ritual, wherein it is a tradition in Ifugao performed in celebration of a beautiful harvest. Punuk, which is held along the Hapao River, marks the completion and the rice harvest and the beginning of a new agricultural cycle. Ifugao culture revolves around rice, which is considered a prestige crop. There is an elaborate and complex array of rice culture feasts, inextricable linked with taboos and intricate agricultural rights from rice cultivation to rice consumption. The forest provides an abundant source of wild meat for the families in Ifugao, wherein children start to fish and hunt at an early age. Wearing of necklaces made of wild boar tusk and crocodile teeth may be centuries old but has been passed down from generation to generation. Men traditionally get tattooed as a right of being the head or taking head. On the other hand, women would get tattooed as a sign of beauty. Mirrored by economic, social, and environmental problems occurred in the prevailing trend of global development, the value in traditional Ifugao culture is discovered as the values of communal cooperation and a sustainable relationship with nature. This is Ifugao.